Hello, this is Mercedes Wilson with Upfront TV, and I am here with the legendary Michelle Barron from Women in the Spotlight Going Global. Um, thank you for taking the time out to talk with us. Thank you for interviewing me. I appreciate it. I don't know if I'm legendary, but thank you. I appreciate it. You are. Oh, thank you. You're welcome. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so let's get right into it. 2010, you wake up and you say... Um, I say that I'm going to create this platform for women to support each other. In 2009, I lost my job. I was working for the city of Buffalo, and it was a very high-profile position. And um, when I lost my job, I realized that there wasn't a network of support for women. But at the time when I created WITS, I wasn't on Facebook. Um, I had a conversation with uh, one of my friends that wrote a book, and I was telling her that she should, you know, republish her book and use social media and, you know, write a second edition of the book. And so she was like, well, how are you telling me about this? And you're not on Facebook. And I said, you know what? You're absolutely right. So I created the group. It was eight of us in the group um, when we first launched. And I just really wanted to get a feel of the type of women that we wanted to include in the group. And so it started out with eight. And what makes uh, Women in the Spotlight Going Global really great is that I'm not the person responsible for adding women. I leave that responsibility on the members. So they're the ones that basically they go through a selection process of their friends and they decide who should be included in the group. So now, you know, seven years later, we have over 2,600 women in the group. But it's a closed group for a reason. Um, because we're, again, very selective about the people that we include in the group. Um, we want people that are really um, focused on the vision and the mission of really supporting and empowering women. Okay. So um, if you're really not um, for that, if you're not about that, then WITS is just not the group for you. So now we're, you know, over 2,600 members in the group. Now that's awesome. It's hard to get 10 women in the room at the same time, but you get 2,600 women. Um, so tell us a little bit about some of the events that you do um, in, in, in WITS. Okay, so every year we host an annual empowerment uh, women's conference. So this is our seventh year. Um, it has it is definitely grown, but it's definitely a lot of hard work. You know, you host events. So, um, you know, from the standpoint of um, selecting a keynote speaker to sponsors to um, just the logistics, the behind the scenes of um, pulling everything together. But I am really um, grateful because I have a team of women that really help me pull it off every year. But um, we host the Women's Empowerment Conference, and we bring in keynote speakers from across the country. Tell us about some of those, because you've brought in some dynamic women. So we've brought in everybody from Valerie Burton. Now you see her on the Today Show. Um, she was our, Actually, she was our first keynote speaker, um, Marshawn Evans, um, and then Deetra Trueheart, who's in our network. She was um, our keynote speaker. Uh, Dia Sims, who is the president of Combs Wine and Spirit. She works directly under... Um, Sean Puffy Combs, she was um, one of our keynote speakers. Um, last year we brought in Juliet Hall from Chick-fil-A. So, and then this year we're bringing in Michelle Thornton and she is the vice president of BET Centric. So, um, yeah, really powerful, dynamic women. We, we've kind of transitioned from the whole motivational piece to, um, you know, women that have truly, um, you know, crashed the the glass ceiling and um and so you know we can learn some really great life lessons from them i mean who better to, to speak to our group than somebody like dia sims that works for probably one of the hardest working men you know in business sean puffy combs so you know we i, I i'm r really um i'm very selective about the people that we bring here um i'm really strategic about it so i put a lot of thought into it before you know we sign on a dotted line but Really, the um, the conference is about us coming together. Um, it's um, it's almost like um, you know people describe wits as a digital sorority, mm -hmm. so that's pretty much what it is. But we come together once a year annually in August, and um, you know we support each other, we empower each other, and we inspire each other. That's good stuff. So a digital sorority, mm -hmm. but you really get the meat because you bring in people that have experiences that can help any woman go to the next level. Oh, yeah, absolutely. So you have a woman that says, I want to be a part of this group. 
Yeah, you have to go through her. So tell tell everyone what type of uh, woman would be the perfect uh, candidate. The perfect candidate would be someone that, well, first of all, let me start off by saying that you don't have to be an entrepreneur to be in the group. So I think that's the biggest misconception that, you know, if you're not a business owner, then you can't be in with. It's for anybody that, um, you know, whether it's professional development, whether you're focusing on your career. Um, if you want to be an entrepreneur, then, of course, it's the great, you know, it's a great network for you. Um, I focus on entrepreneurship because I worked with small businesses for 15 years when I worked for the city. So that's easy for me to share, you know, a lot of knowledge about business because I know a lot about business because, you know, I did that. But I'm not a business coach. Um, <laughs> I'm not a Disclaimer. Business, right, I'm not a business coach, and I'm not looking for clients. But, um, but I think that um, anybody um, from the age of, I mean, Zandra's in our group, Zandra Cunningham, she's our Junior Wits ambassador, and she... I think, you know, when she started out in which I believe she was like 13 or 14. So, you know, we've watched her grow. And I mean, you know, just recently she was on Nightline. So who better, you know, like she's the perfect example of and we learn from her. That that young lady is powerful. She's yeah. powerful and we're learning from her. So um, I think anybody that um, that's really about their hustle, um, that, you know, their um, they hustle, they, you know, they work hard, um, whether it's in your professional life, um, whether it's, um, you know, you want to be an entrepreneur, that's the type of person that we're looking for. And we want women that want to engage with other women, you know, so you know how it is with a lot of face group. Facebook groups you get women in the group that you know they just want to sit back and lurk yeah you know and it's like well why are you here <laughs> you know like why are you here but um and and you have you know you can really really learn a lot from the women in the group because there's so much knowledge and expertise in the group I love it so do you have a date for the brunch this year yes it is August 26 Saturday August 26 okay and what can uh the ladies expect this year so this year um, we are actually going to be hosting workshops. So um, we and we've done it before. Um, we had our, a, a really big event in Niagara Falls, and that was a huge undertaking for me personally to have a, a two-day event. But um, this year we're going to focus on faith. We're focusing on finances, um, uh, personal development, and fitness. Okay. So those are the four areas that we're focusing on. So we're almost um, probably 95% um, complete with, you know, securing our speakers. But we have our keynote, which is Michelle Thornton. And um, we also have um, someone that's going to be coming in doing the fitness piece, which is um, Brittany. I uh, can't think of Brittany's last name right now, but she has a Be Fit. Yes. So she's going to come in. She's um, So she's going to focus on fitness. Nicole Douglas, she's focusing on finance. And, um, and Sharon Jameson, she's um, actually from Atlanta, but she'll be coming in and she's going to talk about faith, you know. So, um, so yeah, all of those things, um, they connect. They, um, you know, those are the areas that I believe that are really important because you can't have one without the other. So if we're not okay internally, and spiritually, then how can we be, you know, super productive and run our businesses or, you know, focus on our career and family? So, ladies, you don't want to miss this event in August. Right. And um, let's let's talk a little bit about membership because you have great things going on. But how can people get involved? So, the first thing is that our Facebook community that is our free um, that's our free uh, group. So that's the Facebook group is free. However, you can't be a part of the Facebook group unless you're a member. So there are some people that have been grandfathered and because they've been, you know, in the group for a while. But we just launched our membership back in August. So um, the membership fee is $75. It's an annual fee, which is, you know, that's not a lot of money. Um, our early bird special was 35, 40 bucks to be a member, but um, it's really about introducing the women to the whole concept of being a member of an organization. And then with that, you know, those funds, that allows us to, to really host the type of events that we wanna host. 
Um, so we try and uh, we have four signature events that we host every year. But um, with the membership and um, just developing the website, so we are in the process of creating a membership-based website. So um, and with the website, we'll be able to um, host webinars and um, you know we're talking about doing podcasts and you know things of that nature. Everything that can really um, educate the women in a group. And again, it's not just about entrepreneurship, but it's about um, just approaching it, um, having a holistic approach to how we want to engage different women from all areas of life. Thank you so much. Thank you for doing what you do. And ladies, this is something you want to be a part of, even though you don't think so, you are legendary. <laughs> you are. Um, and if you want something that's going to give you meat and help you grow yes. uh, in all areas of your life, this is a group you want to be a part of. So thank you for your time you. and uh, good luck on your event in August. Oh, thank you so much. I really appreciate the interview. Thank you.